Okay, the next step, as you can see, is after uh, putting the lines in pencil and then going over them with uh, a burnt umber or a burnt sienna acrylic, what I like to do is I like to give the whole canvas a base coat. Uh, in this situation here, uh, it's not coming up as dark as it actually is. Uh, I like to do um, kind of an, um, a yellow ochre with a little bit of blue. And I look at the picture itself. So I come over to the picture and I try to find a color that overall works. So if you look at the house, it has that kind of yellow look to it. Uh, even in the grass, if you look there, the uh, yellow is going to come through. So just a neutral color. It's an underpainting just to, uh, just to kind of work and pick a color that I like the whole canvas to be because I like to get rid of the white. And I think that's real important to get rid of our white in the canvas uh, because white does change the effect and we'll talk about that more. Uh, the next step is I'm going to uh, be uh, just lightly, loosely blocking in color, uh, creating a glazing effect and just going over the colors very, very lightly and creating a nice, um, a nice rich painting that has a lot of layers.